The father of Jamie Whitcraft tells News 5 his daughter died today around 1030 at USA Medical Center. She died of head trauma. He also says Whitcraft, a student in South Alabama's nursing program, was on the phone with her mother when the wreck happened. This is a photograph of Jamie Whitcraft, a beautiful 22-year-old woman with a bright future ahead of her. This is the wreckage Mobile Fire Rescue pulled Whitcraft from Thursday. Crews worked to pull her from the red vehicle smashed in between the 18-wheeler and the silver Humvee you see on its side against the concrete divider. Jamie's father tells News 5 his daughter, on the phone with his wife before the crash, complained about the mobile traffic. The phone stayed on the whole time. For 52 minutes, Jamie's mother could hear the sirens, police, and rescue workers trying to save their daughter. He said, my daughter didn't even know what happened, what hit her. It was quick. She didn't know. All my wife heard was her breathing, so we knew as soon as the impact hit, that was it. At least she didn't feel any pain. To be a young woman, Joe Whitcraft says his daughter touched a lot of lives. He's feeling an outpouring of support from people all over the country, including people from the University of Alabama, where she attended before joining the nursing program at South Alabama. Jamie had planned to go into the Air Force, a commissioned nurse. According to her dad, she had the world in front of her. She was a leader. People followed her. They listened to her. They respected her. Mr. Whitcraft also talked about the large diverse group of nursing students at the hospital when his family arrived in Mobile from Texas. Everybody gravitated to her because she accepted everybody for who they were, not for what they looked like. Mr. Whitcraft says a viewing for Jamie will be in Woodlands, Texas next Friday. Funeral services and burial will follow on Saturday.